Hi, I'm Yassine Bouhali, sport journalist at the Link newspaper, and I'm here to meet Mickey Donovan, the Stinier's new football head coach. We're going to know a little bit more about him and his goals for the upcoming season. Just follow me, yes. So I'm here with Mickey Donovan. Uh, Mickey, for people who don't know you, uh, what can you tell us about, uh, about your background? Uh, I came in uh, 2002, my first year playing here. Uh, I was here in 2001, sat out, okay. um, transferring from the University of Maine. Uh, Black Bears, uh, played two years there. I uh, came up here and finished, uh, played three years here, and uh, 2004 was my last year. Okay. Um, and, uh, and had a great time. I mean, your background as, as, a, as a coach? I went to McGill for the past two years. Uh, my brother and I, uh, he was working there, we, we uh, started to turn that program around. Okay. Um, they didn't win a game for three years and in our first year we won two and then we won three the following year. So that's a little bit of your goal here. Yeah, yeah, we want to, you know, for us to be back home, we, we want to turn uh, Concordia, you know, into the program they should be. Yeah, tell me a little bit about, because that's the first time as a head coach, are you, how you're adapting. Well, you know, you, you, you're always learning something new every day. Because you don't get a manual how to be it's a head it. coach. No, <laughs> no, no, it's on you. But, uh, you know, to be quite honest, what makes you a, a great coach or a great head coach is the staff that you hire. Um, you got to be able to lean on the guys you bring in and depend on them. And the guys that my brother and I brought in here, um, you know, we're, we're going to be uh, we trust and we, we know we're going to work harder than everyone. Just talking about a little bit about the job of a head coach, can you describe us a typical day? Well, you know, we, we start seven in the morning meetings right now with, with the kids, get them up for school. Um, we, we end around 8.05 to 8.15, depending on who okay. has to catch a shuttle bus back okay. downtown. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, we get them up early, get them going. After that, we come in as a staff. We, we break down our practice schedule that we want to do for the day, mm -hmm. um, set that up, uh, figure out you know timelines from there, and then uh, and then now we're we're taking care of the every ordinary uh, day stuff that, that we got to do for for ourselves for coaches and making sure the team's being taken care of. During and the whole week, you're getting ready for a weekend game. That's it. Tell me what what do you like the most about being a head coach was the part of your job you like the most? I think that the main thing is, is being able to coach with my brother uh, even though you know head coach is, is a title on me but he has as much say as I do. In Does saying, he? Oh yeah 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 he, he, he's uh, so you guys you are know, splitting the job? Pretty much that, that's what that's what I mean when I had this you know this opportunity I couldn't I wouldn't have taken this job if he, he could not come You know, okay. because you, you've got to be able to coach with people you can definitely trust and believe in. Uh, he's one guy that, you know, is my brother, and I can trust him with anything and believe in, believe in him no matter what. Still talking about the job. Tell me what you, what you dislike the most about your job. Uh, having to make cuts. So, I don't, so it just happened a couple of that's right. weeks ago. It's, it's never fun. You know, I, I don't mind uh, get, rid of, get rid of, you know, telling kids that they don't belong here if they can't follow what we're trying to build. Um, I, I, don't, I don't have a problem doing that. I have a problem telling a kid that he cannot be a part of this because I don't have space for him, you know, or I can't, you know, fit him in our locker room. Mm -hmm. It's never fun. Uh, I don't think that, that's going to be fun anytime. No. Tell me, you just coached your first preseason game yeah. and you won it, but uh, how are you planning on uh, having success at the CIS level? Well, you know, it, we got to work hard. We got to, you know, we can't stop, um, especially in this conference. This is the best conference in Canada, and it's very competitive. Each week is determined if you're going to be a playoff team or not. Mm -hmm. um, Sometimes one win is going to decide the whole thing. It, it can. It really can. Uh, and and the, the crazy thing is that they're all great teams in this conference. Every team is very athletic. Um, we all have solid lines. Um, but, you know, now you're looking at the coaching staffs, the, they're all pretty stacked up, you know, at, with, with potential uh, of guys being head coaches somewhere else. One last question I'd like to know. Stingers didn't win, football team didn't win one <coughs> single game last year. Yeah. I'm pretty sure you know that. What about the pressure? Do you, are you feeling a certain pressure that you have to win right away, have a couple of wins this, this season? No, no, you know, my, my, my thought is, you know, I'm coming in with the staff that's here with the, with me and my brother and we feel we're gonna win 
Um, I uh, I don't accept losing, and I don't like it. Um, our guys are working hard. The great thing about this game, anyone can win on any gate on, on any, any day. day, any day. And uh, for our guys that are here as players, um, we put them through a camp that mentally and physically they they never witnessed before. Okay. Okay. okay? Um, Preparation. We that, that's what it's about. If we don't prepare them for the games coming up, for the season that's coming up, and we don't make it hard in camp, how are we going to succeed through uh, an eight-week schedule mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And, and and be you know come out on top at that time? We haven't had a game for me to lose sleep about right. winning or losing. We had the exhibition. It's an exhibition, but at the same time, you want to win everything you, right. you're involved in. Thanks for your time. Thank you. The best of luck. Thanks, brother. Starting on Saturday. At 1 p.m., we're facing the Gators. Yes. And t the game is brought out, broadcasted on Radio Canada. And we'll see how you guys are prepared. Thanks a lot. All right. Coach. Thank you. Appreciate it. Take, Take care. care.